up to anybody who haven't please go and subscribe to my youtube i had a bit i had an idea of a video that i wanted to make um today when i was out in my transportation the post said seek gratitude in all you go through not just look for it or find it or like like not just it's there just seek it like you gotta physically like go not physically let me see how i would say this like you gotta make an effort like when you seeking something you have to you have to look you have to find it you have to search for it and sometimes it takes that search for it look for it look for the good and what you're going through it's the the silver lining may not be it may not be metallic it might be gray but it's still silver. It's in that family. That's all I'm saying. Like it, it may not be like shining and bright and glistening. It may not be diamonds or or um what is called? Hey mahogany platinum. What what's shining? What's it may not be metallic, like I said, but it's a silver lining. It may be gray. So that's how you got to squint to see it. But it's there. Look for it. Take a zoom in. See how I'm zooming? Zoom in. Look for the silver lining. Seek the gratitude. Seek something to be glad, glad about. To be happy about. To be grateful about. I'm just trying to impart some wisdom on y'all. Because I'm a person who's been through many things like cancer and diabetes and heart attacks and stuff like that. And some people, if they had to walk a mile, if they had to walk a, a yard in my shoes, they wouldn't have been able to do it. It would it would have took them out. But I attribute, hey, auntie, my going through to finding some silver lining in it, like like you know how like like I don't know like you just gotta say it is what it is yes but it could be worse it could be something else I'm just I just wanted to get out of somebody because it was on my heart because I was riding in the back of that little raggedy ass van they came and picked me up in today and God it took everything I had in me not to be mad and have my blood pressure up high because hunt that seat I was sitting in was rocking like the seat wasn't welded down properly to the bus or the van or whatever the hell it was oh yeah I got pictures at all I'm gonna make a Facebook video about it I'm gonna put it up on, on I mean a YouTube video about it I got pictures that a little bit and all but I had to I had to I had to kick the comedian in I had to entertain myself at that if i could have went live for y'all i would have but we all know um if it ain't on wi-fi i ain't got it um i could have went live on my other phone but it would not have been it would not have done it any justice as far as how it looked but i'm is this camera rocking i'm so sorry y'all i can't have that i got i i i'm I'm in my springtime or wintertime, whatever the hell. My nerves bad right now, y'all. Because I'm trying not to rock it. I know the people at the doctor's office today was like, well, this whole stop moving this whole fucking shit. Like, the whole little four seats in a row. I was just... I know the people was like, holy, stop it. Oh, no. Hey, Shay Brady. What's up, y'all? I just, I just first of all, like, comment, share, subscribe. I need y'all on my YouTube. I have not been asking for views. I have not been asking for, for subscribers. I dropped the ball. It's time for me to pick the ball back up. I'm high as fuck. I feel good right now. But, um, I feel like I'm fighting to keep my eyes open. I feel good. That's good. Um, if y'all haven't, please go and subscribe to my youtube channel and i'm gonna make this video i want this video. i need y'all to know i just want i want to bless somebody i said i was gonna look for the scripture out the bible that i'm sure um will relate to the situation i just want y'all whatever you going through whatever you going through good bad and different when you going through bad this is what i'm referring to when you going through bad just as hard as it is just just try to take a moment and close your eyes and squinch and just just try to think it could have been worse 
it could have been this. It could have been that. Because when I was riding in the back of that van, I tell y'all, no lie, I was mad. I was mad. I was like, why they pick me up in this shit? Like, okay, so first of all, be grateful, bitch, because you could have been home not at your doctor's appointment. Or they could have not came and got your period, okay? So I had to shut up and get in the little raggedy look. Y'all, I took pictures. Anyways, so I'm in there and I'm riding. And it's the whole stretcher in the back of this shit. Like, they all, what is called all-purpose, all-purpose transportation. They got a stretcher, a wheelchair, a wheelchair lift, all that. What's up, Michael Smoke? So, I just had to think to myself, be grateful, girl. At least you sitting up. At least you fitting in a seatbelt. That you could be so big that the seatbelt didn't fit on you. You're sitting up. You're sitting in the seatbelt. You got up here on your own. Even though they had to use the lift because that's the only way up there. But imagine if I was in a wheelchair and had to be lifted up there. Imagine if I was in a wheelchair that was sitting back there. So I just had to be grateful. I, I had to be. I had to have some gratitude for what I was going through. It's okay. I'm going through this because I'm going through a process to get better. It's okay. That's fine. I could have been laying down on my back. I could have been on my back getting in here. It could have been a morgue bag. So shut up, sis, and ride. That's all. I was like, shut, just shut up. Shut up and ride. I'm just saying, find the silver lining. I'm sorry, I got to stop checking. Find the silver lining. It may not be metallic. Hey, Shaka. It may not stand out. You might have to squinch. You might have to actually look for it. But it's worth it. Look for it. Search for it. When I found, when I'm talking about, I was mad. The people was late and everything. I was really in my feelings. They was late. Then they came with this van. I was like, how dare they? And when I tell y'all, by the time I got to that, um, by the time I got to the place and they opened a the little door to let me down, when I was letting me down off that thing, it was beep, beep, beep. I was like, royalty. I felt like I was, I was, um, coming down out of the, you know how the bitch be on the stage? You know, I remember when Beyonce was up on the shit? Yes, like I was coming down off that shit. Whatever, y'all don't know what's going on. Bitch, the whole attitude had changed just from me having the thought to not be, What's good, Cherie? Not to be caught up in that. I could have been mad. I'm just, I was trying to just, I was trying to elaborate on my post earlier when I said find gratitude. Seek gratitude in all that you go through. Look for the silver lining. It will change your mind. You could sit and be angry or you could sit and be unhappy or you could, you could try to find one small piece because sometimes that silver lining when you grab a hold of it and and pull it it's like a ball of yarn and it just can get caught up in your hand and change your whole mind about the situation because i really i really was upset this morning i was like oh like i was like why did they come pick me up in this i got my eyebrows on and they want me to ride in this like i was a little upset but i got over it and by the time and by the time I was ready to go, I was grateful that that little raggedy van hit. They came back and picked me up. I was like, praise God, he's here. Let that down. Let the royalty up in here. Bitch, I'm royalty no matter where I am. I can ride in a peasant mobile and still be royalty. Let me in here. Thank you. Thank you. Sitting here prim and proper. Taking my selfies in the, in the little peasant mobile. Honey, listen, that AC was blowing. That AC was blowing. That's one thing was working. I was thank you, Lord, for the AC. I thought I had it got over being upset about the, the the actual mode of transportation, and then got excited about the fact that I was going to where I was supposed to be going. So the man was late. He I told him my appointment at nine. He said I get you there at nine oh seven, baby. He got me there at nine oh five, baby. He was dogging it down the expressway, and that AC was blowing. It turned it changed my whole idea because I could have sat there like literally sat there and been like with my lips exactly with my lips turned upside down judging the little car how i'ma do that uh, how i'ma do that and i don't even got no car the nervous some of us but that was a that was a little shit mobile there <laughs> they, they did have me in a little raggedy little bed like real talk the seat was <laughs> the seat wasn't 
Y'all, we was on, what that is, 8th Street? I don't know, whatever street that was. The man hit them brakes. I went to... Bitch, rock me like a pothole. Ain't that what the song say, bitch? He hit them brakes. I hit the whole little thing. My arm... Bitch, I'm about to have an injury. I'm about to call Florida no fault on his ass. But I made it up safely, y'all. Oh, my God. I had my little MRI finally. If y'all remember a couple of weeks ago, I tried that shit and it didn't work. Well, I had my MRI successfully this time. We should be getting some results in a couple of days. Whoa! 